And um, so anyway, that was, that was uh, so much of the governmental aspect of trying to solve things for people, but then we, the school issue became a very important one. And we needed schools. And Rick O'Connell was the uh, head of the school district at that time. Not that he was the, what do you call him? The superintendent. Superintendent. And Phil, uh, uh, Joe Blake knew him very well. Joe, Joe Blake knows everybody. <laughs> and uh, so anyway, we went out to talk to him. And, and Rick was a vape, loved fishing, as do I. But uh, we talked, I think, more about fishing than anything. But anyway, we then talked about schools, and we wanted to have a school there. And they were willing to think of giving us uh, Highlands Ranch High School if we would build a road that would access it. And so that, I think that is why Lincoln Avenue became a real important road over to that area. And we made a deal with them, and Highlands Ranch High School was built. But that wasn't the end of it. And Rick comes in and he said, we need an elementary school. And he said, you need one. I said, yes. So I gave him the land for the Northridge Elementary School. And uh, I feel real proud of that because a little plaque is in the wall. <laughs> I, I'm not a big bragger, believe me, who's ever watching it. So. Uh, but it's been such an experience and, and the school district uh, all these entities became our friends. And it wasn't just because of me, but my guys were really good, decent, meaningful planners and, and accountants and, you know, everything. And we just had a great team here that was just, was fantastic.